Caterpillar came to the to the school and we were notified by the individuals that work at UTI that are the employee hiring team and they they contacted me and said, hey, cat's on site, do you want to set up an interview? So that's what I did and we, I sat down with three or four cat reps and had the interview and they called me back for a second interview and that's when I came out here and uh, ultimately got hired. When I was in the service, I was at Fort Bliss in El Paso, Texas and I guess I heard about UTI from one of my buddies that I served with and we got out together pretty much around the same time and he gave me a call and said, hey man, you ready to do this thing? And I said, yeah, why not, let's go. So that's, that's how that worked out. It was difficult for the military transition part of it, but with good friends and good people that I have around me, uh, going to school was kind of nice because it gives you something to really focus your time on. What made me decide to join this field is that the diesel, diesel isn't going anywhere. It's an extremely reliable uh, market and it's, you know, we use it for just about everything and it's not going anywhere, especially power generation and stuff like that. We're always gonna need power and that's, that's kind of why I got into it. The demand for diesel techs is absolutely probably at an all-time high because there's a lot of these older guys that are looking to retire and the upcoming ranks isn't enough to fill all the guys that are leaving. So it's definitely at an all-time high right now. If they're coming to UTI, then I would say do it. Don't hesitate.